my sadness was soiled and damp, scattering my muddy ground life, where charming coastlines remain clutched in empty bottles of perfume, where torture silently suffered. My soul rolled with eerie sorrow, passing by the amorous tricks, kissing ghosts that stifled my life in moments that could result, but leaving with a no instead. The camera recorded moments. Beyond that, nothing can be known on what is plainly knowable at a precise flashing instant with a repertory of zilch. Vast work goes into studying to gain a knowledge of lovers and reaping the knowledge of them for nothing else comes of its pain which are all front and no substance. Memories change the dull past parts when concerned about what happened through last night and no earlier, losing all innocence at once, not knowing the passing of days. I have lapsed into existence that does not belong to my face, as my night garments stick to me, fastened like the obscure shadows when no stars copulate the sky. The geraniums have harsh smells, being a vulgar reeking plant, but I stroke geranium leaves as numbness creeps up my frail arms, wrenching in soreness down my leg. Wretched, throbbing twist in my gut as the sharp, bloody knife is cleaned by a menacing assassin with his lips pressing down on hers in an embrace of betrayal. My eyes splintered by glass fragments, wondering madly who he is, and she is the bitch of loyans, while both are destroyers of life, but my force will not let me die. My ears hear nonsensical words, driving her strength to tear at me, ripping my shreds of innocence, as unkind numbness comes, then goes, while events are clear, then foggy. He kisses her kind-heartedly, intruding in my frosty home, where my life is swallowing pills to rid her and his warm kindness, where queasy eyes are euphoric. Thank <laughs> you. 